Hi friends, happy Thursday. I'm here with you today to show you how you're going to complete your phonics assignment today. So we have been practicing glued sounds for the past two weeks. So today teachers want to see how you are doing in learning your glued sounds and spelling words with glued sounds. So for today's assignment, it's super important that you're working by yourself. So that means you're not getting help from a grown-up or anybody at home and you are just working on spelling these words all by yourself. So to get ready, make sure you find a quiet place that you can work and focus and you need to decide if you are going to type your words today or write them on a piece of paper. So you have two choices. Um, so if you want to type your words. You don't have to do anything because there is a place for you to type each word on the slide. But if you decide that you want to write down your words with a pencil and paper, you need to get a piece of paper. And with your pencil, you need to number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All one number on each line. And make sure you leave enough space so you can write your words. So that is what you need to do to get ready and have your pencil ready. So what's going to happen is you're going to listen to me reading you a word and then it's your job to spell it. So again, you can either do this by writing your words on a piece of paper or you can type the words right into the presentation. It's up to you. So I'm gonna show you today how to do both of those things. So on each slide, you're going to see a number with a little speaker button, and then a box with lines. So what you need to do is you need to click on the speaker button to hear me read the word to you. Then your job is to think, how do I spell this word? Well, first you're gonna tap it out, and then you're going to either write it on your paper or type it in the box, okay? So I'm gonna show you how to do this. We're gonna do this practice one together. So watch as I click on the speaker button, I listen to the word, I tap it out, and then I spell it. Okay, here we go. This is the first one. Van. 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 My, My mom, mom drove, drove a van, van to, to come, come and get, get me. Van. van. Okay, so I hear that the word is van. So let me tap out van. V, an, van. Okay, so I'm going to practice spelling that word on my paper. So if I'm spelling that word on my paper, I'm writing the letter for V, and then I'm writing the glued sound AN. And I'm going to put it in a box just because that's easier for me. So I wrote VAN next to number one. The word for number one, I know the number because it's on the slide, and I wrote the word right next to it, okay? If I wanted to type this into the presentation, I need to go into edit mode. And I need to click on the box. And I need to start typing where I see these lines. So I'm gonna still type the letters to spell van. Okay, that's it, then I'm done. So then I would click to the next slide and I would do the same thing for number two. Remember, if you were using pencil and paper, you need to put the number and the word next to that number so teachers know which word you're spelling. So I would click to go to the next slide. I would do the same thing. I would click on the speaker and then I would either write my word next to the number two or type it into the box on the slide. If you decide to handwrite your words, Make sure that you are taking a picture when you're done of all the words that you spelled and attaching that to this assignment. And if you're typing the words right into the presentation, you don't have to do anything. Once you're done, you can just click turn it in and teachers will be able to see your words in your presentation. I hope this makes sense. If you have any questions, you can reach out to your teachers. But remember, we want to work by ourselves just so teachers can see how we're doing in spelling words with glued sounds, okay? So we don't wanna get any help from grownups or anything at home. We just wanna use our brains and everything we've learned about glued sounds. This is not for any grade, just for us to check in and see how we're doing and for you to practice spelling glued sound words. Good luck, have fun, and I'll see you next week for more phonics.
Bye, friends.